smart. Next was smart. <laughs> That's right. All right. So glad to see some uh, old faces here today. That's awesome. Well, this is old. For y'all that, for those of you who don't know me, I'm Will Stroll, the president of Odo. Uh, here's our Odo board. We got to. Uh, oh, Kurt's not here tonight. That's no, new. no. So you, you didn't He's sign up. here. Oh, interesting. Anyhow, our vice president Kurt's not here. Uh, we got Bob here, our secretary. Won't. Right. All right, so if you're not an ODUG member, that just means that if, you, if you're not registered on our site, go ahead and do that because uh, there's a special downloads area and, and that's where we also post our uh, uh, the protected areas. That's where always, we also post our, our uh, discounts and promotion things. Uh, so, uh, and then you'll also get our newsletter. And I don't actually, no, I don't like spam you. I only send out pertinent information to, about the user group. All right. Except for when I'm told spam you. No. <laughs> Uh, so uh, some ODUG news. Uh, our ODUG site was upgraded, and that means any all of our posted sites, so like Tallahassee user group and stuff, we uh, post uh, more than one user group. Uh, included with that, we upgraded a few modules. One of them was the forums module. That was awesome because uh, it was kind of weird to get a forum notification in my inbox. <laughs> so that was cool. All right. Um, Masters.com, they, they're the ones that have been giving us the uh, giveaway for the, uh, uh, the sitemap module. They now have uh, uh, we're, we got a new relationship with them again. They're giving us uh, a sitemap module as well as an SEO URL provider uh, packaged up for uh, giveaways now. So every month we're going to get that. So it's the newer version of the, that previous module. Did anybody actually use that? Anybody? No? I'm going to have to use it so I can have an opinion on it. All right. Um, ODA treasure slot. I mean, we, want, we have somebody that uh, is uh, uh, thinking about doing that. We uh, just need to talk about it some more. Active modules, uh, I just wanted to keep that up there uh, in case we got some new people showing up. If you use or like active modules and you're looking to uh, renew or uh, buy their modules, we have a, a user group discount. Just uh, your discount code is the coupon code, and you go to their site, not Snow Cover, to buy it. Uh, let's see here. Odug's on Facebook and Odug on Twitter. Just want to remind y'all, uh, we post a lot of updates. Well, I post a lot of updates about Odug on Twitter, uh, as well as on our news site. Uh, if you go to the What's New, we got our news model there, and we uh, push out news there, as well as on Twitter. And then Facebook, that's if you use Facebook, you know, uh, push out some stuff there. All right, uh, so, so Odug new, or Dot and Nuke news. This has been a huge month for news. There's been a ton of stuff happening with Dot and Nuke, so much so that not everything's on the slide. All right. Uh, basically, the biggest thing is obviously uh, if, if anybody here use Snow Cover, buy modules, sell modules. Uh, they now are owned by .NET Nuke. All right. Awesome. Depending on your perspective, that's a good or a bad thing. All right. <laughs> but uh, uh, overall, I think it, it does uh, allow for a lot of other things to happen. So uh, I think overall, that's going to be good, regardless of your opinion on it. Uh, Let's see, DNN version 495 and 512 were just released, I think, just a few days ago. Uh, maybe Friday or something like that, or Thursday. Uh, I have used four, uh, 512. So far, it's solid for me. I haven't upgraded anything with 512 yet, though, so we'll see. DNN Fusion Partner Program uh, was, was announced. Uh, that's the partner program where uh, you're able to uh, sell for them, right? So if you're interested in selling DNN PE, there you go. And they also, uh, because there's a bunch of us that had a lot of negative feedback to the Fusion program. Uh, they made some amendments to the program, so like if you have a, you know, less than five people or less than 20 people even in your company, you can actually benefit from the program as well. Uh, the PE, they also have an elite edition now, so if you want the PE, you want the licensing and all that, you want the uh, identification for, for all that stuff, uh, they also have elite edition now, so if you, if support is really a major thing with you and you want you don't want any downtime at all. Uh, uh, Elite Edition is really the way to go. Uh, unfortunately, there's no pricing that is placed publicly, but uh, is out there. Uh, let's see here. Uh, they also uh, released the DNN Corp uh, uh, Developer Support Services. I don't really know much about that. I read what he said about it. There's not really a whole lot known about it yet, just what was in that one blog post. So basically, if you're a developer, it's supposed to help you. We'll see. All right. Uh, Open Force Community Choice Awards, that's pretty cool. So if you've ever done like the ASP.NET Pro Community Awards or anything like that, uh, DNN uh, has started with this particular Open Force doing uh, DN, uh, Community Choice Awards. So if you have a site that you think fits in one of their categories, go ahead and put it up there. Otherwise, uh, I'm not sure how they're doing the voting. I don't know if it's going to be people just at the event or what, but uh, uh, I submitted a couple sites today, so we'll see. Fingers crossed. Maybe I'll win one of those DNN bags. That's one of the prizes. <laughs> DNN bag. All right. You put a little um, DNN in there? What? Put all your DNS in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Yeah. 
All right, so uh, Denver and Cleveland user groups have just launched. Uh, Cleveland's run by Joe Brinkman, and uh, Denver, that's where uh, Chris Hammond just moved to. So they just uh, started getting up and going uh, this last month. So they just had their first meetings. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Uh, something new I'm doing with us this year, this month is uh, we're giving out an OTL for news. If you have anything to announce, anybody want to have anything, any new sites, any new modules, any announcements uh, maybe uh, that you have for yourselves? <coughs> what you got, Sam? But I kind of took over just staying downtown for a while, just kind of managing it and consulting until the end of the year. The thing called CoLab Orlando is a kind of a, a concept where people come in for a collaborative work area. And we just wanted to announce that any ODUG members can get a month's free down there if you want to come down here and work. Cool. You know, so check it out. You know, anybody get a month well, kind of like just a, you know, can you use servers or what? Like a uh, office co-op? It's like an office, sort of like an office co-op where we got everything from an open space work <coughs> area to suites and that kind of stuff. So a bunch you of creative that people access. Huh? You get a bunch of creative people together and Brian, you need help, you can help some you help some creative people, graphics people, video Oh, editors. so it's not just for land parties. No, <laughs> there are a bunch of that, we're, we're right at Orange Avenue and Wall Street, so you know we do have fr you know Fridays that kind of gets crazy in there, but you know. Where, where's that? Cool? It's at 37 North Orange, right at uh, Wall Street, and. Um, Somebody told me about it, and I was looking, trying to search for it. I couldn't find it. Um, oh, man. I I it to well, right now there is uh, it, there's a website called CollabOrlando.com. Uh, it's, it's pretty it's outdated. Nice. It, I just oh, registered collabusa.com and it's got just the, you know, under construction dot net new uh, <laughs> site that uh, you know that I'm putting up because I got tired of waiting on other people, you know, to you know do. I think it's in WordPress or something like that that you know we wanted to do something different. And um, but like I said, anybody wants to come between now and the end of the year, you know, get a free month's membership and you know work there just. Uh, you know, let me know and come on in. Hey, Sam, can you send me an email so I can put that under yeah. members only area? Yeah, I will. Right. That's awesome. That's very cool. Thank you. Anybody else got any uh, DNA news? Any projects? No? That you can talk about? <laughs> <laughs> what you got? I've got a, we've got a CRM, CRM module that we'll be releasing in the next four weeks. Hopefully. Uh, we're a little bit late, but anyways, it's going to be, it's going to be pretty cool. And it's going to be, we're going to release it on Snowcover. You missed your deadline. No? I forgot we were talking about that. I know, right? We just got busy on another project and yeah. sort of sidetracked it. But it should be within the next four weeks or so. Hopefully next next meeting I'll, I'll be able to show it. That's exciting. Whatever. And I, I remember telling you before I didn't know of any mails that had one, but I was wrong. Active Modules does have a CRM, but I don't know how extensive right. it is. It's probably pretty simple. Well, the problem is uh, we used Active Modules for a while, but it's, yeah. it's too um, too complex. We're looking oh, is for it? Yeah. From my perspective, we're looking for something more along the lines of 37 signals, um, guys. Mm -hmm. um, so it's good. It's good. I think it's going to be pretty cool. Awesome. That's cool. Anybody else, guys? Charles? Yeah. Uh, we created a uh, solution for doing uh, liens on homes. So businesses come to the, the site to build on top of that network. They can subscribe for $200 every three months. And uh, the uh, competitor of one. It's only twenty-seven dollars a month, but you have to pay two hundred and fifty dollars for every lien that you do. And this, it's unlimited uh, number of liens. So we have about twenty uh, that need modules. Um, we finished it uh, around June twenty-fourth, and there were no defects found after that week. And there was only one change that had to be paid, and it only took forty-five minutes. So awesome. That's only awesome. one. What the third-party modules are you? We wrote them all. Oh, you wrote them all. Very cool. That's what you end up doing. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Anybody else got anything? I was uh, hoping that this might be something that y'all y'all might like. So let me know. You know. Give me some feedback. Let me know if uh, you know this news thing is something you like to do with members news. So basically, anything you want, let, let us know. All right. So uh, our next meeting, we're going to have uh, Henry Lee. You might have met him at uh, uh, Day of Dotnet New. He's uh, from Jacksonville. He runs a company called, I think, New Age Solutions, if I remember correctly. Uh, they uh, do a lot of DNN stuff, so he's going to be talking to us about backing up and restoring DNN. So uh, uh, he knows his stuff, so hopefully it'll be a good session. All right, so some community events. Uh, there's a lot of, everybody all of a sudden got on the ball and started posting all their stuff, so I got a lot <laughs> of events on here, and uh, they're all on our events page. But uh, real quick, just a few of them. OPAS, they meet like every other month.